हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज योर मैथमेटिक्स एजुकेटेड अभिनव झा एंड आई एम बैक विद येट अनदर वीडियो गाइस सो टुडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द बेसिक मार्किंग स्कीम ऑफ जे एडवांस एग्जामिनेशन एंड आल्सो वी विल बी लुकिंग एट दैट हाउ मेनी क्वेश्चंस आर आस्क्ड फ्रॉम ईच पैटर्न दैट एग्जिस्ट्स इन द जे एडवांस एग्जामिनेशन ओके गाइस सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी मोर टाइम लेट्स बिगिन so obviously first of all we have in front of us the more than one correct question in which one or more options might be correct and ye sabse dangerous part hota hai je advance examination ka so i request all the students to solve this pattern questions in the end right so let's uh, understand so sometimes there are uh, approximately six questions sometimes there are approximately four questions from this pattern so this pattern comes in paper 1 as well as paper 2 that's the most unique part about this pattern right you isme sabse zyada questions bhi asked hote hain this is a very interesting fact which every student must know right okay so going forward if you look into this pattern here we will get four marks plus four marks if all the correct options are chosen अगर एक भी करेक्ट होगा बिकॉज वन और मोर इज करेक्ट सो वन ऑप्शन माइट ऑल्सो बी करेक्ट समटाइम्स सो इफ यू हिट दैट थिंग यू विल गेट प्लस फोर एंड इफ ऑल फोर आर करेक्ट यू नीड टू हिट ऑल फोर टू गेट द टोटल फोर मार्क्स इन दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन नाउ यू विल गेट प्लस थ्री दैट इज अ पार्शियल मार्किंग इन दिस पैटर्न इफ ऑल फोर ऑप्शन आर करेक्ट बट ओनली थ्री ऑप्शन आर चोजन राइट you'll get plus 2 if three or more options are correct but only two options are chosen which both are correct right aur aapko plus 1 milega if two or more options are correct but only one option is chosen as the correct option right you'll get zero if you've not attempted this problem and minus 2 in all other cases guys Minus two in all other cases. So, guys, what happens is sometimes, uh, uh, let's suppose only three parts are correct, and you've chosen all four. Guys, you will not get three. You will get minus two, right? So, there's a huge dilemma whether we should attempt this question or not. So, the my suggestion for this pattern would be that students. को जो श्योर शॉट लगता है ऑप्शन उसको जरूर टिक करना चाहिए राइट right? उस केस में आपको नेगेटिव नहीं मिलेगा यू विल बी इन अ सिचुएशन वेयर यू विल बी हैविंग सम मार्क्स आउट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड राइट ना इफ यू लुक इन टू दिस दिस थिंग गाइस दिस इज अ वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग लाइक वी हैव द न्यूमेरिकल बेस्ड प्रॉब्लम हियर सो इन दिस एट क्वेश्चन आर देयर इन अ सेट right in paper 1 uh, or 2 wherever it comes because j advance pattern is not fixed but yes similar five type of questions are asked of different patterns which we are actually trying to tell you today in this video right so in this numerical point so you can get the any numerical value as your answer but you have to round off to uh, at least two decimal places which is very important thing over here Okay, let's suppose your answer is coming as fifty-six point four three nine. So you can round off to fifty-six point four zero, right? So that that uh, round off is very important here, and uh, there is some uh, there might be some errors, which a five to ten percent maximum. Uh, you can say that you can uh, get the leverage, but I would request every student, every student, to get. this answer very accurately let's suppose your answer is 1.9 if you put i don't think so you will get the correct uh, you will get the uh, total plus 3 marks in this situation but the interesting part over here is there is zero marks in all other cases here if you put anything wrong also you will not get uh, a negative marking this is the only uh, question where you will not get a negative marking in any scenario but you will get a plus 3 if you get it correct okay let's proceed so now if uh, the next one is a matrix match it's not actual matrix match uh, which used to come this is from 2022 pattern uh, initially we had a very difficult matrix match in which uh, you had to match one list with the other and one 
point can match with many options as well right it can like uh, you can a can match with p q r s hai na c can match with uh, uh, like p q r s t but now it they have made it pretty simple in the 2022 pattern which i feel is good for the students as well so what they have done is it they have just created it like a uh, multiple choice single correct right so it's similar to that hai na you will have one list and another list and you have to understand ki what is matching with all so you have to solve all the four parts in the list one and you have to match accordingly right it is a sim single correct type but it will definitely take more time because one question you have to solve four parts so four parts you have to solve then only you will arrive at a correct answer if out of four three parts you solved nicely and one part you missed out maybe there's a chance that you might not get the correct option there and you might be fetching minus 1 here okay guys so this is a very interesting thing okay it requires a lot of time but i feel the questions asked from this matrix match are a lot easier right because one question means four questions inside it okay so here you can attempt this question first okay because the individual parts are a lot easy right if i have look if if you look into the pattern in the last few years which have been asked individual questions are quite easy so you can hit this uh, type of questions first in the examination okay going forward then we have a single digit integer okay integer type question right it's a very simple thing 0 to 9 you can feed any value both are included okay total eight questions are there okay in the single uh, in digit integer ranging question so plus 3 for correct zero for not answering it and minus 1 in all of the cases so you cannot bluff around right you <laughs> know what I, what used to happen in my days uh, uh, j advance didn't have negative marking for integer type questions so we used to put zero sometimes because zero was lot of, lot lot of time the answer right what is the angle between uh, some field with the other field physics we used to get lot of Uh, correct answers when we used to put zero, but here it's a lot of risk, right? Because ten, ah, uh, one by ten is the chances of getting it correct, right? It's uh, much different to you are multiple choice. There we we can take a risk because there's a chance of twenty five percent accuracy, but here <laughs> only ten percent accuracy. So you shouldn't uh, bluff in this type of question for sure. Okay, finally we'll come to uh, this multiple. choice single correct so this is this are the, this is also a type of question which you can attend first right you can obviously take these questions initially because they have single correct and it is very important to have a good mindset in j and advance examination these questions are also simpler with respect to the other questions from more than one or a numerical based question you can say so you can attend this question or isme marking Uh, is uh, quite basic. You can say here plus three milega. If your correct option is minus one in all of the cases, and zero if you have not attempted the question. Right, everybody. So uh, this was briefly uh, the marking scheme and the number of questions asked from each pattern in the J Advance examination. We'll be coming up with more videos on J Advance. Stay tuned to this channel. Do not forget to like and share, and definitely subscribe this channel. Thank you, guys.